to your daily bibliomancy. I've been immersed in all things Black Spirit Solstice Summit and so you know I needed to really connect to something and I was guided to you know from our selection of these four I'm going to change it up in a couple of days so just a couple more so out of these four books I was guided to today's selection by Alice Walker in search of our mother's gardens but because I I did my speaking I was the first one today so oh my gosh and um did you know I had a, a line of a psychic sense essential oils? I am an aromatherapy lover from a very long time, just like my librarian high priestess self. So I created this line of aromatherapy a long, oh, many, many years ago. So anyway, and I was taking a break and, you know, connecting to my oil and I was guided to this selection. And so I just, I'm gonna read it, take it in, let me get it out, and I have to go back into our amazing summit. So close your eyes and listen. I was guided to page 14 today. Colette, whose wrinkly, crinkly hair enhances her French, part black face, novelist, playwright, dancer, essayist, newspaper woman, lover of women, men, small dogs, fortunate not to have been born in America. Anis Nin, recorder of everything, no matter how minute. Tilly Osen, a writer of, gener of such generosity and honesty, she literally saves lives. Virginia Woolf, who has saved many of us. It is in the end, the, what, the saving of lives that we writers are about, whether we are the minority writers or majority. It is simply in this in our power to do this. We do it because we care. We do it. We care that Vincent Van Gogh mutilated his ear. We care that a pile of manure in the yard he destroyed destroyed his life. We care that Scott Joplin's music lives. We care because we know this. The life we save is our own. And she penned this in 1976. And I don't know about you, beloved, but. I needed to hear that so I know that and that was the brow chakra that was the brow chakra oil and the writer in me just was ignited how about you how is it expiring inspiring you to hear bibliomancy because as your favorite black psychic librarian it brings me so much love and, and, and just so much pure delight to share this gift and love for books and spirituality and, and and metaphysics and magic and all of it to you. So comment below, please make sure you share it, like, um, you know, um, comment and share it with all of your people because then you'll be entered in a, a, a giveaway if that's something that you are interested in. And so, you know, I know that knowledge is power and it is our time to not only be abundant, but to be powerful. And so we have to learn new tools. If we're calling in the kind of money and the kind of prosperity and the kind of abundance and the kind of life we've never had, we need to learn how to do that. So time for me to get back and sending you so much love and light. Until next time, happy reading.